up everybody? I'm Gobi Cheese, and right now I thought I would make a video just talking to you guys. Just a real casual video. And as far as gameplay, I'm actually playing some Space Pirates and Zombies, which is a pretty cool little game. I, I play it every once in a while. I don't, I'm just not really like super into this one. I mean, I like it a lot, actually. I just, uh, it's, it's the kind of game where you can kind of sit there and play for a couple minutes and make a little bit of progress and then go do something else. So, I uh, thought I would uh, use this for a little bit of chit chat time. Let me see, what do I need to do? Actually, it's been a while since I've played, so I can't remember exactly. Uh, gotta go to a map, ah, space bar, there we go. So, I've actually got a little bit of a fleet going on here. As you start playing the game, you can upgrade your fleet, get bigger ships. Uh, you can actually customize like everything about your ship. Oops, I didn't mean to push refit. Wait, what, what am I refitting into? Um, did I just like eject all of my crew? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's been a while since I played this game. I don't even know what buttons to push to uh, to play. So you can actually eject your crew if they're like inv invaded by zombies or something. Because there are some zombie ships in this game that will like, board your ship and eat all your pass or all your crew members and crap like that. It's kind of weird. So, anyways, not enough res to build ship. What did I do? I'd like. I like told them to refit my ship and then now I can't, now I cannot rebuild it. Oh, that's why. I was gonna rebuild to this like massive ship here. Let's go back to the, I have one saved up here somewhere. Yeah, this one right here, build ship. Okay, so that's the one I was using. I to, so don't push refit ship if you don't have enough money. So that's where I am. Now that I recall, I think I just lost a big battle. Uh, in this game, if you die, you're gonna have to use resources to rebuild your ships, and if you don't have enough resources to rebuild your ships, you basically have to retreat, go mine some ore until you have enough. So it's pretty kind of, it's kind of hardcore in some areas. But uh, anyways, let's go ahead and find an area to go kill some things for the resources. Let's go to system map. And um, what level zone am I at? Yeah, you gotta look at the level of the zone. So uh, star map, I am in, oh see, here's all the like zones that I've been into. Everything that's not grayed out is the zone that I've already explored. So we are here in a level 58 zone, and I am currently level 69. Oh yeah, level 69. What you know about the level 69, boy? Okay, let's see. System map, so let's go fight some stuff. Uh, these ones with the skulls, UTA versus zombies. Ugh, I hate zombies. Let's see. Oh, there's something I can buy from this guy? What, do I, what can I buy here? Fortress shield. So, oh, all right. So, so, different zones have like, uh, like a rebel faction and a civilian faction, and they're always warring with each other. And um, you usually want to buy certain upgrades. So these guys are selling a fortress shield, but you have to have a certain relation to buy it from them. So I need to ally myself with the civilians here. So this is the colony station, and they are very hostile to me. So I need to do missions that give me. Civilian relations up. So, civilian relations up. That's exactly what I need. So, let's do this mission here. Okay. Bounty threat extreme. Oh, yeah. And if you kill uh, certain guys, you get bounty on you as well. So, there's a lot of shit to keep in mind for this game. Uh, and these bounty hunters will come out and they're pretty pain in the butt. And in order to get new ships, you actually have to kill ships. And bounty hunters have like some of the best ships. So, I like to keep my bounty threat high so that I get invaded and try and kill the bounty. Uh, but also, if I'm not careful, then sometimes the, the really strong bounty hunters, they'll, they'll just destroy all my ships and then I have to start back from square one. <laughs> so that kind of sucks. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, destroy some stuff. You can control any of your ships and you can actually have your AI control the other two. I usually control one of the smaller ones because they're more, mo more mobility, I suppose. There's actually zombies here, which sucks. So this ship right here is a zombie ship and they'll actually spit out all these little zombie dudes sometime. This ship right here has a lot of cargo space. It'll pick up a lot of uh, resources. So whenever I want to go mine a lot of resources, I'll just use this ship right here to kind of harvest up. It's a, um, oh fuck, UTA relations decreased. Okay, that's actually not bad. So as long as I don't lose my civilian uh, stuff, what do I actually have to do? I didn't even pay attention. Destroy UTA targets. Okay, so whatever. Let's go kill some guys, I suppose. This little ship here, this guy's fast. That one right there shoots a bunch of uh, little homing rockets. It's pretty cool. Um, so anyways, guys, uh, a lot of people have been asking me, where have the League of Legends videos been? Why are you making all these videos for non-League of Legends games? I thought you were like a League of Legends only channel. 
And so, uh, I thought I would go ahead and answer that. Let's go and repair this ship. By saying that uh, for a while now, and literally for like the last year, I've been a little bit... Um, I, I don't know, I haven't really been putting as much work into my league videos as I would like. You know, I, I'm, I usually, I, I take a lot of pride into making like videos that are really helpful for people. And um, I don't know, if you subscribe to my channel early on, you probably did because you really liked the quality of my videos. Maybe I helped you learn something. But recently, I just feel like I'm not able to put a lot of effort into my videos. Like there's a lot of stuff that I wanted to do. You know, I wanted to continue my seminar academy and do a lot of things, but I just never had the motivation. Oh shit, I'm gonna lose my ship. What, what, oh god. I think there's a uh, zombies killing my stuff. Anyways, I haven't had the motivation to really keep doing stuff. Hope I don't lose my ship. Uh, because, I don't know, I guess I just haven't really been enjoying League of Legends as much as I, as I used to. And that's kind of one of the reasons I haven't been putting out lots of videos anymore. And the videos that I do put out are usually just like commentaries, which I know some of you guys like the commentaries. And in fact, I, I don't mind doing the commentaries. I like them a lot, but it's not the style of video that I wanted. Like if you go look at my channel from way back in the day when I first started it, it was a channel that I, w I did to make like helpful videos and guides for people. And you know, I like doing the fun videos too, but for the most part, like my favorite thing to do is to just make stuff that help people learn to play games better and you know you know I can entertain you at the same time if possible but you know that's not my main thing I'm not trying to be like a comedian or something like that because I know I'm not fucking Adam Sandler or anything you know but uh, I don't know I just haven't really been enjoying League of Legends and for a while in the last couple months I've been kind of depressed uh, you know slightly just because I'm like man I'm just not enjoying myself at all and I feel like I just want to do something else and Maybe I just need to focus on some other games. So I'm taking a break from League for now. I may go back to it, who knows? But for now, I'm gonna go ahead and play some other games. Path of Exile is now in open beta. And so you've seen that I've been doing a lot of videos with Path of Exile. So that's been kind of like a big focus of mine. And the reason for that is because it's, you know, it's kind of what, what Diablo 3 should have been, in my opinion. And a lot of people think that as well. If you talk to people who play Diablo 2 and Diablo 3 and have now tried out Path of Exile. So, uh, I think what I'm going to start doing, and, and now that I moved in with a couple of my roommates, is I'm probably just going to start doing some videos with them. I'm going to do some, some more Let's Play stuff. Every once in a while I'll get emails from people and they're like, hey, why don't you do Let's Play stuff anymore? And I only did it for a little bit. You know, it was like back last year during last Christmas or something like that. I, I put out a lot of videos that, um, that were like Let's Play style and stuff like that. God, these ships are really hard. I don't, this is a hard ass mission. But I really did like doing that. You know, I did some stuff like with Orcs Must Die, like Orcs Must Die walkthrough. And there's a couple other games I'd started doing walkthroughs. I just didn't finish them because I went back to doing League of Legends. And it was really hard for me to figure out the, you know, how much time I wanted to spend doing that. And, you know, and then I was like, well, I don't want to saturate my channel with other games since I'm focusing on League of Legends. So I tried to make a second channel. And I just didn't have motivation to start a second channel. But I did like doing the Let's Play stuff. So... I don't know, I've tried a lot of different stuff out over the years and I haven't really stuck with one thing because I haven't made good decisions on like, you know, this is what I want my channel to be. But for now, I, you know, after a lot of thought, I, I, th I think I'm just gonna go ahead and, and just do any video that I do on my main channel. And for now, it's gonna be me playing uh, other games and hopefully, you know, the guys that, that like my channel and like me and like the stuff that I put out will stick around and for everyone who like, only wants to see League of Legends commentaries only. Well, I mean, I guess you can unsubscribe and, you know, that sucks. I hate to lose you, but um, that's just where I'm at in my life right now. And so, yeah, I'm gonna be playing some video games. Maybe you'll, maybe you'll find some other games that you like because I'm gonna be showing you some stuff. Path of Exile, Space Pirates and Zombies. I got a bunch of other stuff that I bought on Steam from the Steam sale that I still have to get to and I just haven't got a chance to get around to because I was spending so much time playing League of Legends that I was like, damn it, I'm never gonna get to play these games because I'm spending all my time trying to play League of Legends. God, this is really hard. These ships are not dying. <laughs> Maybe I should have went, went to like a lower level zone, I don't know. But anyways, Space Pirates and Zombies. Now that I'm kind of done talking about League of Legends and stuff, uh, this game is really fun. It can be really hard if you go into a zone you're not prepared for, if you don't have a strong enough ship, you know? For example, um, God, I've already lost more res than I started off with. That's not good. I usually try to come to these zones to gain resources so I can get to a harder place. But if you're, uh, 
if you're not careful, you can end up just losing all your resources and not make any progress at all. Um, what I'm going to do is select everything and tell them to attack one target. That should help. The higher zones you go to, they're going to have higher research. Like um, Levels don't actually give you anything. Like You don't get more stats for leveling up, but you can actually put points into certain things. So like I've been putting points into my cannons and shields and armor. And anyways, whenever you go to zones that have higher research level, like this one's uh, like you know 50 something or 60 or whatever it was, uh, they're gonna have higher shields and higher weapon damage and all that stuff and so if I went down to a lower zone They're gonna have like shitty shields and I'll just like one shot everything with my badass overpowered cannons that I've got right now So that's kind of the difference there and man that ship is just running away like crazy. I can't even catch it with this guy I'm just gonna have to switch targets Right now I'm trying to get to a, um, a main quest area, so it's like uh, I can't even show you until I until I finish this mission, but um on the star map, there's there's main quest areas, and once you complete the main quest, you uh, you unlock more stuff. So I'll probably unlock like another hangar slot or bigger ships or whatever. Um, in fact, I've actually got big ships unlocked. I just haven't unlocked any big ships because I've not killed enough really big ships in order to uh, complete the research for them, and it's just really difficult to kill them right now because the only place you can find the really massive ships is in high level zones and I can barely even fight stuff that's like 20 research points below me right now as you can see. So uh, overall I'm just slowly working it in and you can like lower the difficulty level a little bit. I've actually lowered it to like uh, normal instead of like hardcore mode. I had it in a hardcore mode kind of like for a little bit and I was like this is just way too hard. A little bit too tedious. It depends on how much you want to play the game. Oh there's a pretty big ship right there actually. That's, uh, that's gonna be an issue. Yeah he just killed my little guy. I don't think I even have enough money to rebuild. Fuck my life. Oh my god. Okay, so let's see if I can kill this guy without getting wrecked. He's shooting some photon cannons at me or whatever. I don't even have enough range to hit him without getting in range. I, I do have some... Uh, oh shit. Oh no! I don't have enough maneuverability on this guy. Oh god, get out of there. I'm just getting hit. Sometimes my AI will just... Look at that, my AI is just retarded. Alright, I'm going to have to repair this shit. Alright, let's get out of here. Get out of there before you die! No! So this guy actually has auto cannons, so I can be running away and the cannons will turn and shoot stuff for me. Which is good. Which is good. Where's my base at? Shit, it's way up there. Right, I'm gonna start heading toward my base. And it's not even a base, it's just like a it's like a waypoint type thing. Oh, my cannon's like not gonna shoot stuff. We really need to kill this little ship because it's annoying. It's just so many shields right now. I can't even like bust these shields down. Oh boy. Come on now. So I actually recently got Nino Kuni and Dungeon Land. And I was thinking of playing those games. Also I wanted to play I wanted to do some kind of uh mine I was thinking of doing some Minecraft thing. I'm looking for some Minecraft mods, like some hardcore Minecraft mods. I wanted to do like a you know, like, you, you die and your world's deleted. And I was going to do that with my roommates. We're going to, like... We, we're looking for some, like, mods. Maybe, like, some extra monster mods or whatever. Just something that would be fun for a hardcore playthrough. You know, something where there's a lot of extra stuff to explore. And maybe a little bit more danger than just the regular zombies and shit that's in the game. So, I don't know. What do you guys think about that? Maybe you guys have some suggestions. I'll, I'll be reading the comments, of course. If you guys have some suggestions on what you might like to see if we do some Minecraft playthroughs, then I'd be glad to hear it. I think you guys would... Uh, like, like my roommates, they're kind of funny, and we always have good times. So it'll be like Kobe Cheese and Friends play, except instead of uh, us playing League of Legends, it's us playing other games like uh, like Minecraft and stuff like that. So it should be fun. Uh, I think I just lost my middle ship, middle sized ship. That's actually really bad. That was a big part of my damage. This ship is just like a, just a mining ship. This this guy doesn't have a lot of damage. That's why I can't kill these guys because I don't have enough money to build my like massive destroyer ship and and like. I just keep dying and I can never, can like never make any progress. I'm probably gonna have to mass retreat. Like they have, yeah, I'm just gonna mass retreat. So basically I gained absolutely nothing from this mission and I lost all my ships. So that sucks. I think I lost all three ships. So uh, that's a good place to stop here since I can't do anything. It's probably gonna take me like an hour just to build the first ship again by mining like little bitty asteroids and stuff. So that sucks. Oh well. Should have learned my lesson. It's been a while since I played this game, so I guess I forgot how hard those zones were. Well, I'll see you around for the next one, guys.
thanks for watching this video and uh, make sure to subscribe if you enjoy my Let's Play stuff and if not then sorry about that and I'll see you around. Peace out.